I'm Pastor Tyrell Bramwell, and this is a canceled Christian comment. Halloween has long been a time for children to dress up and ask for treats, but this year in Eureka, these practices were co-opted by the nonprofit organization called Redwood Pride, which hosted a Dreammaker project at the Jefferson Community Center. The event was promoted for all ages, and young children indeed were dragged to the spectacle where they witnessed adults dress up in bizarre Halloween drag and perform erotic dances for tips. An obese lion thing sexually strutted his sideburned stuff past a little girl to twerk on the lap of a member of the audience before moving on to grope another costumed attendee with a face-to-face -face air kiss and a chest-to-crotch rub of a is that a mustachioed Orthodox priest? Hey, I think that's cultural appropriation, and I'm offended. It would seem that the LGBTQ community understands Scripture better than many Christians in Humboldt County. What is it that Proverbs 22, 6 says? Oh yeah, train up a child in the way he should go, and even when he is old, he will not depart from it. As Deuteronomy 4, 9 says, only take care and keep your soul diligently lest you forget the things that your eyes have seen and lest they depart from your heart all the days of your life. Make them known to your children and your children's children. If only Christians took this instruction as seriously as the LGBTQ, I mean, why else would a bunch of adults invite children to witness their confused, clumsy, and perverted sexual performances? As I watched the footage, Captured by LostCoastPopulous.com, the truth was evident. Grooming, indoctrination, desensitization to perversion and evil. And that's without the poor lip sync of Green Day's American Idiot, which, yes, was played as an anti-American anthem by the crowd who cheered the words F America and seemed to internalize Billy Joe's line, Well, maybe I'm the faggot, America. I'm not a part of a redneck agenda. And we thought the LGBTQ stood for diversity, equity, and inclusion. Where do the rednecks fit in? If they won't take you, St. Mark's will. Let's talk. The reality is, as Moses recorded, that the things our children's eyes see will not depart from their hearts. Turn away, kids. That's demonic. Nope. Such guidance will get you labeled as a hater, a bigot, just like it did the concerned parents who showed up in protest and have been mauled by our local media. You're in my prayers, guys. Thanks for loving your children and for caring for your community. 1 Peter 5.8 teaches the Christian, Be sober-minded. Be watchful. Your adversary, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. The kids who watched a man dressed as a lion earn money for a homosexual dance may not realize it, and their parents may not know it, but the devil was on the prowl at this event, and he is devouring their souls. I'm Pastor Tyrell Bramwell, and this has been a Cancelled Christian Comment.